I'm going to make some uh, whole wheat panna pasta with all these ingredients smoked salmon so what people eat with smoked salmon tomatoes and onions and cucumbers and the mushrooms I'm throwing in there for taste and this little slightly not even hot pepper there's not going to be any measuring on this whatever you see in front of you can go a little more one way or the other it's about seven mushrooms a couple of tomatoes or one tomato and cucumber I'm only going to use half that cucumber so let's go about putting this together and cucumber has been eaten hot so it's nothing unusual and I think it should go well with the uh, smoked salmon as far as the amount of smoked salmon there it is you don't need a lot and it's going to go in at the very end so it doesn't get destroyed as far as the cucumber that's the only thing that I'd like to see nice so about this long like so and we're going to cut sticks because this is already seedless you take the seeds out and you just go like so and then we'll saute this and that should be enough and we're not making cucumbers with pasta we're just adding this as a as everything else is a little bit of each and the rest of the cucumber mm-hmm delicious now let me get started here the only thing that's not going to go in there well a couple of things I'm not using any herbs because smoked salmon has a unique taste I don't want anything interfering with it the items that I'm putting in there are not going to work against it no garlic, no herbs and have a pot of boiling water next to it because when we start this the pasta goes in the water. They should be done at about the same time. We got a high flame going, extra virgin olive oil, no sauce. Of course, we'll put some salt and pepper in there. Let that get started. I'm going to put a little sea salt in there. And I'm going to put some pepper. You can use black pepper, white pepper. And since I'm eating this now after I get done, I'm going to put some cayenne pepper. Because that's what I like. I like it hot. Now, the water that's boiling, look at the amount of salt I'm going to put in there. Think it's a lot? You wait a second and then you taste the water. If it has a slight salty taste, you did a good job. If it doesn't, you need a little bit more. But you, because the pasta has to come out of the water with its own flavor. So it, you can eat it just alone. And now we're dealing with a high, high flame here. And we'll saute this. Everything is going to be reduced here, so just let it keep going for about, that's an easy five, six minutes cooking. Did I mention white wine? I don't think so. So, uh, here goes the good dry white wine. I didn't put the pasta in yet because this is going to take a little while. This has to cook down, reduce and almost no liquid left just the oil well that's reduced quite a bit now we're going to put the pasta I'm going to make uh, about a half a pound that should be good now that it, what I'll be doing here in a couple of minutes, I'm going to throw the cucumbers in here. 
and after I drain the pasta and not rinse it off, because you never rinse off pasta, then I'll add the pasta to this, at the same time the smoked salmon. So the smoked salmon will still look nice, and not like you do see it sometimes when they make these smoked salmon omelets at parties, and the smoked salmon is like disintegrated. Anyway, mmm, nice taste. I should have put the pasta in a little bit earlier. Well, then I put cayenne pepper in there, but I like it. So I'm going to hold this down to a simmer. <coughs> I'll shut it off. Now I have to wait for the pasta. See, timing is so important. But it's not a big deal, really. It's more important to have this part of the recipe ready than the pasta. Well, the penne is almost ready. This is hot again. Before the cucumbers in there, it will just take a minute to soften up. Remember, the uh, whole pasta takes a little bit longer than white flour. So allow for a couple of extra minutes. Slow on this. Pasta is almost ready. You don't have to use whole wheat pasta. You use whatever you want. You don't even have to use penne. Anything. I'm just using whole wheat because Trying to cut out white flour. So we have this. Another minute. We should be ready. Now we shut this off. Everything in there is cooked. I'm going to take the pasta over. Drain it and bring it back. Pasta, scallions. Smoked salmon. Very unusual dish, but I will enjoy it. I always like to try different things. I know what hot sam smoked salmon tastes like, I know what pasta tastes like, cucumbers, everything that's in here. If you know what each item tastes like, you could always say, hmm, will it go together? There, that's it. I'll get some, get it on my dinner plate. And sit down. And enjoy this. Well, that half a box, yeah, that's enough for two people. I hope you enjoy it. 